Ah, what a beautiful snowy day! What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name's Seth, and we are back again for some more Terraria 1.3. Uh, so, I haven't been able to do too much since the last episode. You may also hear in my voice a little bit. Uh, I've been recording quite a bit, not necessarily Terraria today, so hopefully I'm up for the task, because my voice is very parched. I added this little window right here. I'm noticing this star up here. Uh, I also added these chests, and I noticed that you can actually rename your chests. That's totally new to me. Absolutely awesome, though. Where you just go right here, you can go to rename. You can also restock, as far as I know, is taking everything out of the chest. And quick st stack puts all the items that we have of the... Yeah. <laughs> Self-explanatory. I click quick stack, it takes the star out of our hotbar and puts it right down here. I'm sure everybody already knows all this stuff, but it's all fancy and new to me. Also, I ended up finally listening to all you fine, beautiful people. Everyone kept telling me how to use that smart cursor. I had no idea what it meant. Uh, we can actually toggle it, and it actually makes it like the 360 version, where it automatically starts digging uh, your character size in a wall in front of you. So that is absolutely awesome. Uh, I'm going to have to get more used to that, but I am still, again, so surprised at the fact that... Yeah! Take that, Jerry the Penguin. It's still so surprised at the fact that this game plays so tight and actually takes care of all of its own limitations by giving all of these crazy options and stuff. Now, also another thing too, which uh, was suggested a while ago, but I only actually got to do it right now, is I've made the screen a lot smaller, obviously. Let's see if we can go into this ice area today. Yeah, I knew there was an enemy over there because that's the problem with the smaller screen is I myself personally am going to have a little bit of a harder time fighting the enemies off and knowing behind our map here. Uh, I was trying to look online if there was a way to actually make our map smaller or anything like that. As far as I know, you can only change the transparency, so honestly, I'm not sure. Let's do this. Oh, there we go. <gasps> I see, so it can let go of shift while we actually have the tools selected. There seems to be a bunch of stuff down there, which we will get to that in a moment. Oh my goodness gracious. Yeah, so I'm going to get a lot faster at playing this game, but it is still going to take some time. Uh, the other thing, too, that is quite obvious is the episode length is definitely a little bit shorter today. That is because I want... I, I already mentioned this in the last episode, but it's just taking me a little while to get used to it. Is I'm going to try and make Terraria a lot more common of a series because everybody seems to be into it. So, of course, I want to be... Uh, delivering it a little bit more often as well. Now, I'm noticing that there's a bunch of ore hanging on the top of the ceiling. I don't know why I'm taking the long way. Instead, of just doing this. Whee! <laughs> I love that, man. Uh, so, is this going to work for when we're mining ore as well? Yes, it definitely is. Making it a lot easier as well. Ooh, there's some tungsten over there too. Perfect. Uh, so far, for the most part, we are pretty much still just getting our ore and resources up we are pretty much prepared for quite a few things that we could kind of do like I, I personally am not exactly sure what we're supposed to be going for other than just getting ourselves some ore and stuff like that do we actually need what's up there no we don't who cares we what is all of this junk right here is that more of that weird that tungsten that we just went by I love this smart digging though man that is absolutely awesome the way that works Oh, it doesn't seem to work going down, though, does it? No, maybe it doesn't. Maybe it's only... Yeah, it only seems to be smart digging on the left side of us. So, okay. Okay, so that was lead, which is still very helpful. Oh, my goodness. Gadzooks, that was a close one, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, it was. Ah! <laughs> that was a double close one. Take that, you were freak. Step skills. Yeah! Oh. Take that. Get out of here. Yeah! All right, we got him, just as I planned. It looks like this cave keeps on going. My goodness, this is great. It's like a Duracell battery. Power up, just keep going over 9,000. <laughs> what is all this junk? Oh, I should leave that uh, smart digging on like all the time, shouldn't I? Come on, there you go. I just wanted to put a torch down. Whoa, all right, let's get some of this crap. Oh, I see, so there is a little bit of a disadvantage. Ouch of having it on 24 seven. 
I'm noticing that trap. We actually just got poisoned as well. <laughs> okay. That works. Well, at least we can still just dig straight up from... What about going sideways? Can we do that? Oh, that is so awesome. It's like Donkey Kong Country or something, man. I love that. Okay. I, I love these ropes, man. They are so crazy cool. Let's get that death trap out of there. Grab ourselves this pressure plate so that we can maybe end up using it a little bit later. Oh, we got in our heart. We got some more health. Awesome. Now, oh, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Where is? There we go. Uh, we don't necessarily need our glow sticks, but I do want to actually have them on us right now. Bloop. Let's throw them out. Throw them down there. <laughs> Get rid of them. I like how we can put a That was a close one. I like how we can put a torch on the ground to kind of... Can I get all this junk out of the way? Okay. 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 Whoa. That was a close one. I, I'm trying not to. There we go. I didn't want to end up making our ropes go straight down too much. Not yet, anyway. I guess we can do it right now, though. Do -do 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 -do. Take this, you stupid slimy freak. I don't know. Oh, why did he let go? I see, because we weren't actually hanging from the proper rope. Let's leave another torch on the barbecue. Oh, my goodness gracious. Ah! <laughs> no! Yes! Okay, so he at least equips the glow sticks perfectly because he's smart enough to know why would you ever use anything else under the water. Oh my goodness. So we got a bunch of gold down here, but unfortunately we are going to have to try and see if we can get some of this water out of our way because blub 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 we're drowning and that's not gonna be any good we were drowned before we ended up getting that gold there we go give me all the precious gold give me it all i want every last bit of the resource please thank you very much wow we had a waterfall going for two seconds there now it looks like yeah we're not gonna have enough breath for this uh hopefully we can dig fast enough oh goodness oh goodness yes Dig faster, please. Dig faster. Dig faster. We gotta get the water out of here. There we go. We're free. Don't worry. You won't drown. Yes, we will. Oh, my goodness. That was so close. 22 health to spare. Wow. <laughs> that was so close, man. Seriously, I could have died. Uh, okay, so you know what? It looks like we actually ended up getting... No, I don't want to put the torch down. Thank you very much. And there's an infinite water source right here. So it seems like they're a lot more common than I than I thought. Uh-oh. We're running low on our ropes. I'm using it too often, man. <laughs> we should be we should probably be regathering our rope, but you know what? That's okay. That's okay. I, I have a feeling that we're gonna I have a feeling. Whoa! The ice! The ice to meet you. I have a feeling that we're going to end up running into something special very, very soon, aren't we? Well, we got some more rope at least. Whoa! It's too slippery in here, man. <laughs> so we're probably spending the majority of this episode, that's for darn sure, in this ice cave. So, bit crazy here. Whoops, not F7. What was it? F11. That's how you get rid of the hotbar. Or get rid of all the keyboard commands and stuff. No! Oh my goodness. Whoa! Okay, keep attacking the wall on our right. Ah! No! That was a close one, man. I'm having, like, such panic attacks. Oh, this game is too tense. What? What is that? What is that? What is that strange creature? It's a granite something or other. I don't even know what it is, but it's dead now. Take that. What did it drop? What did it drop? Granite block. Okay. I don't really know what that was. That's pretty crazy, though. Anyway, you know what? Since I'm noticing our time right now, let's see if we can kind of rush here. I, I honestly don't think we're going to run into anything that's any more exciting than that strange creature, seriously. Other than, what is the glowiness down there? Ah! Cave bat! <laughs> Alright, perfect! We ran into a beautiful ice slime and another heart. So that is a perfect item to actually end the episode on. Let's use that right now. Give ourselves a little bit more health. 
And that's going to be it for this week's episode. Not this week. That's right. This is a more common series now, but we're going to call it here. So thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to smack that like button, share favorite, and subscribe to join Team Vixen. Sign on. Stay epic, everybody. Believe in yourself.